Hi everybody, I'm glad you're all here. Thank you very much for joining me. Hope everyone had an enjoyable 4th of July weekend. Today is July 5th, 2023, and I'm Mary with Mary Greeley News. There has been three earthquakes so far today along the New Madrid fault zone, starting out with a magnitude 2.5 right up over here. And then there was a 1.4, and then just a little while ago, a 1.7. No one said they felt these earthquakes. The first earthquake of magnitude 2.5 was at 1.16 a.m. Maybe you felt a little rumble. I don't know. Maybe you thought it was something caused by some of the fireworks. The next earthquake was at 4.12 a.m., a magnitude 1.4. And then the most recent was a 1.7 at 5.05 a.m. local time. Now that one was supposedly Tennessee and the other two were Missouri. Interesting fact, even though the earthquake of 1811-1812 is called the New Madrid Fault Earthquake, um, it actually started down here by, let's see, Blytheville, way south of New Madrid. Okay, and then there was three aftershocks. I could only find the location of two of them. Um, they were within 48 hours. There was a 7.0 and a 8.0. Those were on the 16th. You can see all these were on the 16th, but I couldn't find the location of the third aftershock. There was also in 1812 a magnitude 8.4. And then the one they named their, all the earthquakes after up by New Madrid uh, was a 7.4, possibly an 8.0. Um, all these earthquakes actually started along the Cottonwood Fault or the Grove Fault. Um, there was a series of four of them along this fault zone. And this side actually rose up to the west and then the side to the east actually dropped down creating the real foot lake so more than likely the third earthquake the third aftershock after the magnitude um, 8.6 earthquake was probably up in this same location yeah population was real sparse back then they don't even know how many people were killed because um being an independent state they really didn't have any type of infrastructure to keep track of who was living where. So did you feel any of these earthquakes? If so, please put your comments down below. Um, they were pretty early in the morning, so if you were going to go by your pets being upset, they might have been upset because of all the fireworks last night. But put that information down below. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. As always, be prepared. Uh, the government is not going to come to your rescue if there's some major disaster. All they care about is the continuancy of their government, their form of government. Yeah, they have spent a lot of money on their defense, not the defense of the United States citizens. In my opinion, if they cared about us, they wouldn't have open borders. They wouldn't be sending all that money to other countries. They would invest it in our infrastructure, in our schools taking care of our veterans, etc. Just looked at what happened um, after Hurricane Katrina. It took almost a month to get in there to start rescuing people. One of the first things they did uh, when they did come into Hurricane Katrina disaster areas was go door to door and remove people's guns. So what are your thoughts? Thank you for your support. Always be prepared. Please stay safe, and I will talk to you later. God bless you all. Bye.